Hi everybody, it's Carla. I'm back on a Monday. I wanted to show you what I put together. I've been working on this little baby for about a week and a half now. Um, her body came in today from Bountiful Baby, so I actually got to put her together. But it, she is a little witch baby. She's the Riley kit from Bountiful Baby. It was on sale, so I got her. And um, she's made with a lot of thrifted items. And uh, she's got a couple of new ones. Her little lovey, which is a pretty owl, that's uh, all with stars and purple and yellow fur and big yellow eyes. That was from Burke's Outlet, so that was a new item. And then this little hat is from Dollar Tree. They're putting out their Halloween items. And this came on a hard uh, plastic headband. I took it off and uh, through the bottom of it that was covering uh, where they stuffed it, I uh, wove in a headband that I put around her little head, like right there, you can see it under her chin. So that's holding her little witch hat on. It had a, a long uh, lace overlay on it and I cut that down because I didn't want to cover up the baby face. And she's painted with the air dry acrylic paints. I think I used uh, six or seven colors of green and I just kept modeling them and then I used a couple colors of purple. and. Um, made the orchid color lips that she has and the uh, highlighting around her nose and on her cheeks and on the creases and then she has black fingernails right down here she's got the purple under her hands uh, I named this baby after um, one of Samantha's aunts on Bewitched and I made her a little bracelet and her name is Enchantra uh, the beads were um, some that I had. This is that kind of uh, chain that you use on a ceiling fan or a keychain. And those were uh, just something I put together for her. Um, this little skirt that she has, which I attached to a uh, onesie um, with these pins, it's holding it up there. But it was like a size 6 of a girl's Hello Kitty skirt. And I just uh, cut it down to fit and ran a seam up the back but it's got um, it's got this pretty mesh and then it's got sequin and then it's got solid black so it's very flowy very pretty and it's got a silver top up here which matches very nicely her hair which was a silver thrifted wig and this was a Halloween wig probably from last year but um, I washed it conditioned it and she has this pretty hair and then a little bit woven through there she's got some uh, little bits of green hair and um, she's got thrifted eyes that I got from out of another doll uh, to use on her these pins came from the thrift store they say bad witch and then here she's not a bad witch but it was just cute and here's a little witch riding a broom there her passy is a uh, thrifted passy. It actually had a moon and stars on it, and I took a SOS pad and scrubbed that off. She does have a magnetic pacifier there, so you can see how that fits on her sweet little face. This one fits her really good. I tried a couple. I had a couple of orange ones, but this one fit the best. You can see right there, it's very close around her face. I didn't put eyelashes on her. I'm wanting to get some eyelashes. Um, I didn't uh, root the eyelashes for her, so I was wanting to get some I could apply, but I just haven't done that yet. Here she's got um, purple in her ears, and she's got little green uh, elastics that are holding her hair up in pigtails on either side. Um, her eyebrows are painted, and they're a little thicker. And they're two colors, they're kind of a grayish underneath and then a black on top. Uh, here's her other second little pigtail right there. And I crocheted this um, little afghan that she's laying on out of some thrifted yarn as well. So it's got two shades of green and one uh, like an off-white color. Here's her little feet. You can see the underside of her toes is purple. And some of the creases are purple and the tops of her toes are purple. And she's got black... Um, nails, the creases on her legs here, 
Now this um, little onesie, it fits her good long. She's 22 inches long, and that's the body I put her on. But this is actually a three to six month size, so it fits her perfect, except right around the neck, so I kind of pinned the back of the neck up. I'll have to fix that. Maybe put a dart or two in there or something. And here's her other leg and her other foot. And there's her one hand. You can see the purple on it. Yeah, I just had a lot of fun. These were those, uh, if you watched one of my later videos of the newer paints I got at, um, at Walmart, and they were out of a British company. And uh, I don't remember the name offhand, but they are excellent paints. And, uh, yeah, I could just go down the line. I went through all their greens and did layers on her. So I got a lot of that. And then a little bit of purple, oh, pink, and magenta is what made this uh, coloring around her face and around her lips. Yeah, she's just really a sweet, sweet baby. And, um, yeah, I just thought I would make her... Uh, try to make a few little um, creative kind of uh, uh, art dolls instead of just baby dolls. And I have some, I found some really pretty wigs over the weekend, and uh, they're all new in packages. And I'm uh, hoping to root uh, another doll down the line with some of it. Yeah, I'm just very very pleased with how she turned out, and I love. Her little owl lovey, she just, that just looks awesome for her. Here's her other sweet hand. And right there. So I hope you like this little one. She doesn't have a neck ring. I didn't put her on. I just kind of left her, um, I kind of understuffed a little around here, around her neck, so her head kind of can go side to side. But I also, um, you can move her head, but it just, you know, um, I just didn't put a neck ring in her this time. But she's really cute. And yeah, just my interpretation of a baby witch. And I know with fall coming on and Halloween coming, people will be making witches and stuff. And I just kind of wanted to make one while I, the idea struck me. And I'm hoping to um, make start on another kit here soon. But I wanted to show everybody what this sweet little girl looks like. And again, her name is Enchantra. And she's Enchantra the Baby Witch. So I hope you like her. And um, yeah, I love seeing everybody's dolls that they're making and that they're buying. I enjoy everyone's YouTube videos. And uh, I hope you like this sweet little uh, baby witch. Okay, we will talk to you later. Wait, bye bye. Bye. <laughs> okay, everyone, thanks for watching. And uh, please uh, comment and subscribe. And uh, click on like if you like this video. I appreciate it. I like the feedback. Thank you very much. We will talk to you later.